and a happy March 10, 2020 to everyone. I'm channeling my inner let's get physical. Actually, let's get physical with our inner ear information. We all have something called a saccule. It's our ancient inner ear. And this is something that utilizes the eighth cranial nerve. It bypasses it so that we can actually hear cleared broadcast. The saccule contains small nerve endings called macula and a small tissue cap called otoliths which contain calcium carbonate or sand light particles. You've probably heard of this when people have vertigo and they do a tilt test. When the head tilts, the small particles shift within this and uh, it advises our brain through the parasympathetic system um, about our posture, our upright posture. Um, it's our virtual gravity uh, detection system with information that just basically circumvents the need to actually have to use our physical ears. Now, I am using right now the original NF3 uh, from Patrick Flanagan. I'll show you what it looks like. I don't know if that's backwards because of the mirror um, image. I also have the more later version, which is called the Neo Neurophone. Now, the Neo Neurophone has three settings, an orange mode, which um, broadcasts the Fibonacci mode. It stimulates the alpha and beta waves, enhances focus, concentration, increases the blood flow to the brain, which oxygenates um, the brain. It helps to align the right and left hemispheres with a vibrational wave using bone resonance. Um, it's the same as the uh, whales, the dolphins. They use that sonar wave. They have a sound that sends out and then it can sort of feel what's happening above, below, to the right and to the left and many, 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 many miles out. Now the blue mode uses the Fibonacci low, which stimulates the gamma and the theta brave waves. Um, for deeper concentration and meditation. Um, it also helps um, aid in the circadian rhythm so that you have a little bit more sound sleep and enhancement um, for that sonar wave that we all have access to, but we're not trained to use it until we are. Um, the green mode uses alpha, beta, gamma, and theta wave, which are all looped which is very similar to what the NF3 does. All three sounds are looped. You really don't hear much of anything or feel much until you understand the NF3, whereas the Neo, you feel the tapping that's happening through the uh, piezoelectric transducers that are sitting, like I said, right underneath this headband. Um, the green mode um, stimulates for um, enhanced memory, information retention. It's great for learning, uh, learning a different language. It is how I was able to learn um, uh, kinesiology, anatomy, physiology, all the systems, everything practically in an overnight load, uh, download. Um, the quiet setting is really cool um, because again, you can master plugging in and listening to anything you, that you want, whether it's through your smartphone, preferably on an airplane mode so that you're not putting those waves in your head. Um, for me, I'm a migraine and seizure sufferer, or it's just where the kundalini energy is locked in the upper left quadrant of my left side brain. And so it feels like there's batting practice most of the time that's taken place on the back of my head and through the left side of my head and it's very unpleasant and these neo neurophones have really helped now i maintain the neo one traditionally for me um, the nf3 i allow um, my clients to use my friends to use um, but it's just another way to help you trend to center that still point, that center point that we're all seeking. So hopefully this information is informative. If you have any questions, I'll put a link below to my website with uh, access to me through private message. Um, again, 3-10-2020, the end of a Mercury retrograde. Nothing feels like it's going backwards anymore. The end of our first super full moon. I'm relieved. I hope you are too. I hope you have a beautiful day. Love and light. Here's just a little send off to help that DNA, RNA have replication in a sense of purity. So um, the one hand goes over your heart, the other hand maybe over your belly or your solar plexus.
take a deep breath in, and then just simply sigh it out. Have a beautiful day, everyone.